So the camel gear came to me in a, in really a dream. I, uh, one night, I, one morning I woke up, I had a dream that night, uh, basically, of a, uh, we were at the sale, the pure hockey sale, and um, a veteran came to the door with his old duff, army duffel bag, and I woke up and kind of thought of an idea of camel. And a couple of days later, we were traveling to Easton, uh, up in Montreal, and at the same time also, my father-in-law, uh, Richard Grenier was uh, in a hospital, uh, basically passing away. No, the, the, the whole concept and idea came out uh, uh, at a family gathering uh, when uh, my brother-in-law, Rob, uh, mentioned that he had uh, in a dream uh, the idea for um, the product line here in, in honoring my father. Uh, so I, I uh, certainly we were all um, really taken aback by, by uh, his wanting to honor uh, my father, Richard, um, with this uh, kind of remembrance. Uh, it, was kind of a, it was kind of a neat adventure. And we started the idea back in September of 2014 and took many renditions uh, to find the right camo, to find the right product. Um, and we think we nailed it. We, the product came as it, as it evolved. Um, with the name, uh, we changed it from a, it was a 7.5 protective to the RG series in honor of my father-in-law. And uh, it's really, I think it's, it's really taken a life of and its the own. The surprise of, uh, that, that our father left so much, you know, he left a great impression on, on so many people by the way he faced his challenges um, over the last three, four years uh, as being a, a double uh, amputee, leg amputee. And, and I think the, the fact that he carried himself so positively towards that, uh, that whole time, uh, all those challenges and difficulties with just a focus on certainly playing golf again was his uh, main focus, but just being a, do, to, to trying to do as many things as he did on a daily basis, uh, even with his challenges. But it, uh, he impressed a lot of people. I mean, I certainly had uh, uh, seen that during uh, his services. Uh, all the folks that came up and said that he was an inspiration to uh, to them and to a lot of people. So that's why uh, we were so uh, amazed that uh, Rob wanted to uh, include him in, in this type of remembrance, just because uh, we didn't realize uh, how much of an impression we made uh, he made on, on on Rob as well. Um, but that's really the story behind the RG series. It was it's a dedication to my father-in-law who did pass away uh, September 28th of 2014. He was a, a Air Force veteran. Um, and this is to honor him and to, in the same time, I, I wanted to honor him, find a way to honor him, uh, but also give back uh, to a charity. And so with that, we've also are donating 10% to uh, Defend the Blue Line, which keeps and helps people who are veterans to keep their children playing hockey and supply them with some equipment.